What's going on guys? This is a follow-up video to my previous ad hoc party and PlayStation Vita tutorial. A lot of people have still been asking me questions about how to get it work, so I decided I'd show you from step one. First thing to start with going to the PlayStation Store and downloading the ad hoc party client. Hit the search function in the top right and type in ad hoc party. there it is should be your first selection a little green icon just click it and download all right now that that part is done should be good to go just boot up the ad hoc party there it is first selection So this is all really simple. Usually everything happens automatically. So I'm trying to show you that it does work automatically by downloading it from step one, booting it up for the first time. Okay. PlayStation Vita is now in the frame. Boot up your PSP game of choice. I can see my reflection in there. Can you? All right, so here we are. We'll run up to the guild hall. Now, before we do this, let's go back to the ad hoc party. Hit start, and you're going to pick a couple worlds. We'll the American ad hoc party is not that many people playing it, so it's usually rolled one or two. Has the most people in it. Blue means less. Red means most. Yellow means moderate. Pretty sure I won't be able to get in. Yeah. 32 is the limit, so you can't get in, so I'll go in this one for now. Pick a pick a room. The one has four four. Two four. Four. Okay, let's see. Wrath no armor. Let's go in it just for the sake of seeing how it works. All right, notice I didn't do anything to set up any to set up the Vita or set up the PS3. I just booted up the ad hoc party, booted up the Vita. Now we're gonna go in the online gathering hall. Okay, now while that's working, watch the PSP icon under the yellow name. See how it picked it up automatically. Now we're loading into the gathering hall. As you can see right here, it's already automatically picked up their names, so everything is working perfectly. Hope this video helped you out. Stopped all the questions from coming, so there you go. Have fun. Also, last thing I forgot to mention you guys, to get this ad hoc party application to work, your PS3 must be connected to a wired connection. If it's connected wirelessly, this application will not work. The reason for this is because the PS3 must use its wireless connection to pick up on the Vita's wireless connection, and that's how it works. I hope this helped you guys. Please like, subscribe for more. If you have any questions, just leave it in the comment section and I'll help you the best I can.